Hey guys, welcome back. Now, let's talk about conditional statements, also called if statements. A conditional statement is a way of making your program do one thing if one thing is true and the other thing if it isn't. For example, we could say, not in real Java, in pseudocode, if I am hungry, eat nachos, else uh, put nachos in fridge. This is like a real life if statement. If you're hungry, eat the nachos, otherwise put them in a fridge. Now in Java, if statements function exactly the way you think. For example, if we say if 5 is bigger than 4, greater than symbol, and say system.out.print line 5 is more than 4. Otherwise, we can go system.out.print line 5 is not more than 4. Now, if our math is behaving correctly, we should see that 5 is always more than 4. In fact, it's giving me a warning saying that uh, we can net, it'll never reach this point because 5 is always bigger than 4 no matter what. But if we run this, it'll say 5 is more than 4, just as we thought. Now, we can also use variables in if statements like we learned before. If we say int x is equal to 5, and then if x is bigger than 4, we should, oh, semicolon, we should see it says 5 is more than 4 because x is 5 and x is more than 4. Now, there are, you don't, there are several different forms of if statement. The simplest is just if condition code. That's if something is true, execute it, otherwise don't. We can also include an else. So we can say, for example, you know, if I'm hungry, eat nachos, otherwise put them in the fridge. You can also put an else if to put another condition. So for example, we could say if I'm hungry, eat food, else if I'm thirsty, thirsty, drink water, else don't do anything. You can put as many else ifs as you want, but it's best to you know, avoid getting more than like 10 or 20 else your code becomes completely unreadable. You can use if statements for a lot of things. You could, for example, say if Robbie dot any beepers in beeper bag, or if Robbie dot facing south. There are lots of conditions that robots give you as well to do with conditionals. Initials are a very useful tool. Everyone uses them, and they should make your programs a lot easier to write.